So itong mga to sir, ito ba yung mga ano? This could uh, be the typewriters as well as the uh, adding machines that they used during the time when they still had their business. This is actually an infant crib. Okay? Infant crib. Yes. Okay. And what is uh, good about this piece of furniture is that this is the only piece of furniture that I have seen that is... So, nandito tayo sa bahay, ang ancestral house ni Jose Osamis. Ayan. kitchen. Now, I would like to draw your attention to this place. There, there is some kind of a door here, okay? Before going to the... The dining area. The muchachos, muchachas were restricted coming in here during that time, Okay. They were, they were only allowed to come inside here to serve food or to do some works requested by the, uh, the owners, owners of the house. Most of the time, they stay here or if not downstairs during siesta time. They were not allowed to sit on the furniture. These were only for the family members. Okay? That's why the floors are always uh, kept uh, clean polished okay and not anybody can just come in here wow. okay. <coughs> Excuse me, huh? Excuse me, huh? the chairs here are made of solid nara and uh, typically during the time since there were no foam or leather leather uh, during the time they used soliha okay soliha soliha Yes. You have to make a sound. So, para sa anyan sir. Uh, when you call for like breakfast, lunch, or dinner, calling for calling your for the, family members family to come members. for a meal. Ah. So, to make a sound. Oh. So, paano naman yung for your maids pag tatawagin mo? They have their own bell, di ba? They yun shout. Yun? That is the one, di ba? They shout. Muchacho, muchacha. Ah, really? Yes. Ganun po ba yun? So, but to call for family members to come in for a dinner, for lunch, or for breakfast, or to uh, to call everybody for a prayer, they always have to use this. Ito naman, Sulihan de Pilanas. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So again, so, you have the, tayo, here a doorknob that is made of glass. It was used during that time. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay. Ano yan, sir? This is actually an infant crib. Okay? Infant crib. Yes. Okay. And what is uh, good about this piece of furniture is that this is the only piece of furniture that I have seen that is an Atai crib made by Atai during the time. As you can see, this uh, oh, this wow. uh, distinguishing uh, design, which is uh, kalabasa, yeah. and the kind of uh, you know craftsmanship they have for the. Uh, Legs. This design is attributed to Atai. A friend of mine who is an antique dealer have seen this long before. 
uh, and uh, said to me that uh, this family has an authentic Atay crib. Crib. Okay. However, because of the passage of time, I think uh, something was replaced here. This used to be a soliha, but now it is uh, plywood. plywood. Na plywood. So probably it was destroyed after several years. But then, oh, indeed, this is an atay piece. Uh -oh. Atay piece. Mm. <coughs> And it's cut. Oo nga, sir. Pinutol na po. Pinutol na siya. Okay. Now, this is a later addition, I believe. Terrace for the family. You know? Probably they they stay here uh, to watch processions coming. Oo nga, sir. Okay. No? Uh -uh. But uh, I know this is a later addition. As you can see, the grills, okay, the grills, they are they are already welded. Tsaka may, may ano sir, oh, ah. Jose Osamis. Hinaro Osamis. Hinaro Osamis. Hinaro Osamis. They have this piece of furniture we Hinaro. call Tumba Tumba. And, and it's still an original piece. Okay? It's only that a, a component here is missing, but it's original. The Suliha is still original. Original din po siya. Yeah. What do you call this one? So this is the woven rattan. Suliha. 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 Uh, it's made of rattan. Or Suliha. In, in Cebuano, it's Y. Y. Yes. <clears throat> and there, there are some interesting items here. We have old maps of Mindanao. Oh, oh, nga, Probably still during the time of Senator Ozamis. Old maps. These are new maps. And I think this is the map of Misamis Occidental. Okay. That's the map of Misamis. Yes. Misamis Occidental. Capital Oroqueta City. Okay. That was... Uh, there were already 14 days yes. still. Municipalities. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, parang sign na po ni Julio Zamis. Ito naman nakalock. Yeah, nakalock. I'm sure meron silang mga atay bed frames or ano. Kaya sa mga bedroom nila. No? Actually, wala. Ah, wala. Only that. That one is an atay oh. piece. Ano yun, sir? Uh, this is a very important piece of furniture as you enter the house. Okay, this is what we call a bastonera. Okay, bastonera, where where uh, visitors or even family members coming from outside would put their baston here. Okay, you know what baston is? Yung the baston, yung uh, tungkod. Tungkod yeah. yung cane. Cane. Okay, and then uh, if uh, people were or family members uh, wear some hat, they are going to put it here. Okay, put it here. Uh, otherwise, if they are using uh, coat, uh, onion? coat, coat, they are going to put it here. Okay, so this is the actually the first furniture that you would encounter as you enter the house. Okay, before going out. And then you have here the seal of the family. Uh, Osamis. Tunan mo na lang sir. Ozamis. Oh. This is what we call a lancena. 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 This is uh, supposed to wow. be placed near the comedor or the dining table because oh, oh. this is uh, where they are going to put some cooked food ready for serving uh, or probably some uh, uh, plates coming from here inside. They are going to put it. Uh, Take it out and put it here, ready to be, uh, to be placed served. on the table. And the spoon, the fork, and uh, as well as the knife are put here in uh, on the side. drawer. Okay. So mm -hmm. this is lancena. Mm -hmm. So itong mga to sir, ito ba yung mga ano? This could uh, be the typewriters, typewriters as well as the 
uh, adding machines that they use during the time when they still had their business. Uh, I know they, these are original uh, equipments coming equipment coming from this house. And then uh, meron po kayong malaking mga Oh, nga, laki nito. Okay. This is an original piece and I think this is number 3, the biggest one. Uh, that one is number three. Ma, may, number, may numbering pa Yes, may numbering yan. Mm. Pero may number one, number two, number three. Depende sa size. Oh, ganun pala yun. Oh. Diba? Siyempre, maalay natin. Basta alam ko, bangang malaki. Mm. Oh. Ha, ah, si sir nag-CR. Mm. Okay. Mm. Airport? Seryoso? Wood, wooden ba yun? Thermostat. Ano kayang taon ito, no? Oh. Okay. Tawagin, mo nga, tawagin nga natin si Sir Michael. Ah, well, you... Siya ang nakakaalam ng mga taon na yan. Eh. So si Sir Michael pala, siya ay isang antique collector. Expert siya sa mga antique na mga gamit kung kailan ginawa at uh, ayan, siyang expert dito Sir, may aircon doon, baka ma-recognize mo kung ano, anong taon yan 1920s ba yan? Joke? Okay. <laughs> This is mga 1970s Oh, 1970s O, oh, diba? Ventilation Ventilation It's still manual Uh, early, late 1970s. Uh, still working. Uh, uh, Madam uh, uh, Madam uh, 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 Ito, add-on na to sir, ano? Oh, add-on na yan. Luma in the sense is vintage. Vintage, oh, yeah. Not real. Meaning, uh, it was there less nung than pinayo. Less than 100 years. Oh, less than 100 years. How do you, how do you differentiate the two years between antique and check-in? Okay, antique is at least 100 years. How? Okay. Uh, below 100 years. It's still vintage. Vintage. Vintage na. Okay. Even the toilet bowl. Yes, bago na. Bago This na. This one, medyo bago na. Alam mo, meron kami ganyan sa toilet o toilet namin. Matigas yan, sir, eh. We are sitting on a dining table that is good for 12, extendable for good for 24 persons. So, this is the cabisera here where the head of the family, being the father, would normally sit. And on the other side is the mother. And on this side are the children. Okay? So, since... Uh, The Osamis family have 10 children, so it's five on this side, five on this side, the father, the mother. So, once they call their uh, helpers or muchachos to come in to bring some food, they will always ring the bell. <laughs> so, we would like to introduce... Our host coming from this house, Madam Nala. Leonela Verhai. Leonela Verhai. Verhai. Leonela Verhai, who has been here working for the family for the past. 51 years. 51 years. So, nasa kanila po kayo, mga ilang taon po kayo? Ilang taon? Ilang taon po kayo? Ilang taon po kayo? Ilang taon po Ah, 20 years. 14. Ah, okay. Okay. 14 years old kayo pumasok dito. Okay, so that's 37 years. You've been working in this house for 37 years. Okay, that's Leonela Berhai. Berhai. Si Ma'am Lenny Umalsa. Lenny Umalsa. Okay. Ilang taon na po kayo dito, Ma'am? 7 years pa. 7 years pa. Okay, so at least you have been here for 7 years. So, kumusta naman yung pag-trabaho uh, nyo dito? Okay lang po, sir. Okay, okay lang. Okay. Hindi lonely. Hindi lonely. 
<laughs> okay lang. Enjoy lang kami dito. Okay, okay enjoy lang kayo. So, uh, in this house, uh, palipat-lipat kayo kung saan kayo uupo. Oh. Ah, okay. Saan so, kami mag-CR, saan kami maligo. <laughs> saan kayo matulog. So, you are more than the owners of this house. Yes, so oh. said. <laughs> Technically, ganun. <laughs> so, let us say hi to our viewers. Hi! Hi! Welcome to uh, Casa Osamis in Jimenez, Misamis Occidental. We hope that you will ha- you will find time to visit this wonderful place here in Misamis uh, in northern Mindanao, uh, particularly in Jimenez, uh, to be with us uh, in this uh, beautiful municipality declared as the heritage town of Misamis Occidental. Thank you for your time and we hope to see you one of these days. Bye. 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 Okay. See you. Okay. 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 Yes. Tapos dito sa loob may meron silang ano bang meron sa loob? Tingnan natin. Hello. Lantern room. Ayo, may mayong bunta. Tag, tag. Hoy. Ah? Oh, para makita natin yung taas. Oh, ang cute ng papi. Okay tayo. <laughs>